Hello and welcome to Animal Watch and today we are at the World of Lupine Foundation Summer Show. Say hi Eve. Hi Eve. Wolves and wolf dogs have to be two of my most favourite things on planet Earth. So when I heard that there was going to be a special day in the UK which encompassed these wonderful animals, I was only too keen to pop by and see what it was all about. Wolf dogs of all sizes and shapes arrived in the baking sun, some low content and some high content. There are also some beautiful wolf lookalikes and many rescue dogs and non-wolfy breeds. So who's this? This is Luna. Hello Luna. <laughs> and what type of dog is Luna? Luna's a Tamascan. Oh, old. you're a Tamascan, you're beautiful. <laughs> I'm Gemma Krasinska. And uh, what's the names of your beautiful so dogs? This is Millie and this is Bella. And what type of lupine are they? These are both classic lupines. So they're uh, just sort of like your, your regular lupine as it were. They don't require a huge amount of specialist care. Yeah, what, what, what breeds do you think have gone into the background of these two? So these two, well, I, I know. Um, so Bella is um, obviously grey wolf. German Shepherd is the predominant dog breed. There's also a little bit of Husky, a uh, little bit of Malamute um, and a tiny, tiny bit of Samoy. Oh, a little bit. Oh, and then Millie the pup over here, um, again her predominant dog breed is German Shepherd and then she has a rough collie and a kitter. Oh, how interesting. A little tiny, tiny splinter of Malamute again. Oh, bless them. This is Aya and my name is Felicia. Aya. Aya's a beautiful name and Aya's here today at the Lupine Foundation and what type of lupine is she? She is a classic lupine. And um, what breeds, do you know what breeds have gone into her background at all? Yes, yes. Their dominant breeds are German Shepherd and Grey Wolf. Lisa, you have a beautiful dog. Thank and what's you. his name? His name is Nando. And what type of, of wolf dog is Nando? He's a classic lupine dog. He's mixed out of Silus, Czechoslovakian wolf dog, and White Swiss Shepherd. Oh, wow. What a wonderful mix. Yeah. Well, he's an incredibly handsome, beautiful yeah, dog. Thank you. With incredible colour. What's your name? I'm Nikki. And who's this? This is Sid. Sid is big. He's very big. <laughs> He's very, very tall. Very and tall. what type of blue pine is Sid? He's a mainly northern Inuit with a bit of Salu's wolf dog in him. He's very good. He's very chilled, very laid back boy. I'm Jay. And Jay, and who's this? This is Yogan or Yogi Bear. Yogi Bear, what a name. And he's such a puff ball, isn't he? <laughs> he, looks, he looks like Poor a Yogi brother. Bear. Um, yeah. What type of lupine is he? So he's a British lupine. Okay. Um, it's mainly cross between German Shepherd, Part Wolf, and um, Timber Dog. Hello, and who are you? Uh, Eloisa. And who is this dog? Her name is Liana. Liana, yes. so pretty. And what type of dog is Liana? She's a Tamascan. A Tamascan. And she's related, isn't she, to the other Tamascan yeah. dogs here yeah, today? Yeah, her full litter system. So the World of Lupines Foundation is really there. It, it, its main role is to educate, support and register and they're really out there to help support um, wolf dogs and wolf-like dogs, specifically uh, the breed that they register called lupine dogs, um, which is a, a multi-generational health and temperament tested uh, wolf-like dog. <laughs> okay, so that can include anything because Winston here, originally a North Aid dog, which you have now registered as a lupine dog, but that could be Czechoslovakian wolf dogs, could be Salus, it could be mixes of 
all of the above. If they pass the, the standard test, the, okay. the, the temperament tests and, and, and the health tests and okay. type tests. The, the purpose of the show here is, is to bring everybody together, it's to provide that community spirit. We're obviously evaluating the dogs uh, for, for their confirmation, their health and their movement, that's the purpose of the showing. But also it's about giving the animals and the people opportunity to mix and mingle. So this is my son Kai and Kai is 11 and um, he'd love to say hi to, to Winston here. He's so enthusiastic because of the sheer size of him and enthusiasm of him. You, you, you know, you, you could get a puppy nibble from him and, and lose an <laughs> earring or get a black eye. So this is why training is so important for yeah. them. Uh, they're just so enthusiastic. <laughs> yeah. Well, you're doing a wonderful job with him, Natalie. He's, he's beautiful, fantastic ambassador. Hi, I'm George Stapleton, and this is Nandau. We are here at the World of Lupines Foundation Summer Show. Landau is owned by Lisa Kemp and he is participating in the summer show. What's so important to understand is that the Lupine dog is bringing the domestic dog back to what it originally was. And that is what this animal is representative of. Now, how are you involved in World of Lupine Foundation? Uh, so I'm the Vice Chair in the World of Lupines Foundation and I deal particularly, my role is dealing with the registration of the dogs. Okay, and um, what makes a really good lupine dog? Uh, well, first and foremost, obviously being a good pet, that makes a really good lupine dog. Uh, being as natural to, to the form of a natural canine as possible and being healthy. Tell us a little bit about Eve again in case other people haven't watched my other programme. So what, what is Eve? Well, nowadays what we call their advanced lupine dog, which is what you would know as a high content wolf dog. Part of the day included the Lupine Foundation Summer Show to judge these beautiful low, middle and high content wolf dogs in accordance with the Lupine Foundation standards. The non wolfies then had a shot at some classes and I was delighted to have been judged for the fun and rescue section. If you want to find out more about the World of Lupine Foundation, you can visit their website which is www.worldoflupinesfoundation.com for watching Animal Watch and I hope you enjoyed this episode on wolves, wolfies, wolf dogs, all sorts of fantastic lupine dogs including this gorgeous boy here called Sid who I absolutely love, he's absolutely fantastic and remember to tune in every single week to Animal Watch where you will have episodes on all the above, the wolves, the wolf dogs, dogs, animal rescue and conservation and be sure to check out my son's channel which is Master Wolf Gaming over here. He does beautiful animation on wolves. You have to go check out his channel. I'm going to put a little link in the box below. And remember to subscribe by clicking that little button in the bottom corner right now and I will see you next week. Take care.
bye for now. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.